going on guys let's look at this problem right here this question is asking a loop of wire making a cross-sectional area 114 centimeters square is placed in a magnetic field the magnetic field direction is perpendicular to the plane of the loop the strength of the magnetic field increases uniformly from 1 tesla to 1.0 to tesla over 1 seconds if the total resistance in the circuit is 4.6 ohms what is the magnitude of the induced current in the loop here the question is asking to find out the induced current in the loop to find the induced current we have to use this formula i is equal to emf divided by the resistance here if you look at this one we have the resistance provided we have to find out the emf to find out the emf we are going to use the faraday's equation faraday's equation is emf is equal to d phi by dt and this phi represents the magnetic flux but we don't have the magnetic flux so we have to rearrange like we have to bring another term instead of d phi we can replace this d phi with a times db area times the magnetic field divided by t okay so this is change in magnetic field over time now area is provided that is 114 centimeter square to convert this one into meter square we have to multiply this one with 10 to the power of minus 4 and that's going to give us the meter square and change in magnetic field is going to be 1.02 to minus 1 okay 1.02 to minus 1 tesla divided by change change in time this is happening over one second so the time is going to be just one second okay now we have this one now let's calculate this value instead of 114 we can replace this one with 0 0.0114 and this is going to be 0 0.02 and if you multiply these two together you will get 0 0.000228 and this can be written as 2.28 times 10 to the power of minus 4 and this is voltage okay emf is in voltage now we have the emf we have the resistance provided so we can find out our induced current now to find the induced current i is equal to emf divided by the resistance emf we just found out that is 2.28 times 10 to the power of minus 4 divided by the resistance that is 4.6 ohms and if you calculate this one you will end up with 49.65 uh, no this is wrong this is actually 49.565 okay point times 10 to the power of minus 6 ampere since they are asking in micro amperes we can write this one as 49.57 because this is two decimal points so 49.57 micro amperes and that's going to be the final answer i is equal to 49.57 micro amperes and that's how we do this kind of problems i hope this helps thanks for watching